In this video, I wanna to talk to you guys about how I got $700 worth of signup bonus within a short window. But before we get started, I have a quick message. Welcome to another video. If you're new here, my name is Dwayne with howtobuildcredittv.com. And on this channel, we talk about everything you need to know about credit, credit cards, and how to make money using credit cards. So if this sounds like something in which you're interested, be sure to subscribe to the channel and click that notification bell so you don't miss a thing. Okay, so back in August 2018, I applied for a lot of credit cards. And in this video, I just wanna to talk to you about how I was able to earn $700 worth of cash back applying for four credit cards. So back in August 2018, I basically got on a credit card application spree and I was like, I want credit cards. I'm going to apply for the sign up bonuses. I'm going to apply to get cash back. I'm going to apply to earn points. I'm going to basically apply for a lot of credit cards. Now I apply for the sign up bonuses, but of course, most of these cards are cards that I wanted and most of them have no annual fee. So I went ahead and applied for several cards. And in this video, I want to talk to you about four cards that I applied for, which allow me to earn $700 worth of cash back. And I applied for them kind of like August, October, basically the end of 2018. So it was really kind of cool because I applied for these cards and I ended up meeting the minimum spend and getting like $700 worth of cash back that I then turned around and used towards paying for some of my Christmas gifts for my kids so it was a really sweet deal i was like man i should do this every single time in the latter quarter or the last quarter in the year i should apply for some cards that you know have some pretty sweet sign up bonuses and uh you know use that cash back or use those points for gifts for christmas so that's exactly what i did and uh that was like really really cool i really enjoyed it the first card that i signed up for that had a sign up bonus of 200 dollars at the time was the Amex Blue Cash Everyday card. Now, when I applied for that particular card, the sign-up bonus was $200. This sign-up bonus normally goes anywhere from 150 bucks all the way up to 250 bucks. I've seen it at $250. Now, most of the times when it's at 250, it's normally because you use a referral link. Now, if you're interested in getting the Amex Blue Cash Everyday card or any other card from American Express, I'll be sure to put the link below this video so you can just click on that link and go to the American Express website and use the referral link and you'll get a better sign up bonus using that link then you will going directly to the American Express website. So I'll be sure to put that referral link below this video. So I went ahead and got the Blue Cash Everyday card from American Express and the minimum spend I think was $1,000 in order to get 200 bucks. Now that wasn't too bad. Um, I enjoyed it quite a bit. So I was like, I'm definitely gonna get this card. And I got the card and that particular card from American Express, the Blue Cash Everyday card is an actual cash back card. So I went ahead and got that card, I was super psyched, and it was really easy to meet that minimum spend of $1,000 in order to get back 200 bucks. So that was the first credit card that I used to get or on my way towards $700 within a short window. The next credit card that I used was the US Bank Cash Plus Rewards Card or Cash Plus Visa Signature Card from US Bank. Now, I went ahead and got this card because I was like, well, I think US Bank is pretty sweet, and this particular credit card allowed me to choose two categories where I can earn 5% cash back and one category where I could earn 2% cash back. As far as I'm concerned, this particular credit card from US Bank is kind of the black sheep when it comes to 5% cash back credit cards or cash back credit cards in general. Now, I like the card a lot because like I said, it allows you to choose two categories where you get 5% cash back. You choose those two categories. When you're in the position to choose the actual category that you get 5% cash back, it makes it a lot easier to accumulate a lot of points faster. So I really like this card a lot. And at the time, I think the minimum spend was 500 bucks in order to get 150 bucks. So I totally had to jump on that. And I did get a proof of that card, like I said, back in August or October or whenever, 2018. And the limit on that card was $6,000. The limit on the Amex Blue card was initially $7,000 when I applied for it. It's now $6,000 because I moved $1,000 over to another one of my American Express cards. So the second card that I used to get $700 within a short window was the US Bank Cash Plus Visa Signature Card. So the next card that I ended up using or applying for to get more cash back 
was the Bank of America Cash Rewards card. Now this is a cashback card, and once again, all of these cards I'm talking about, the four cards I'm talking about, they have no annual fee. So at the time when I applied for that particular card from Bank of America, the sign-up bonus was basically $200 after spending $500 within a three month window. So as you can see, this was very enticing. I was like, sweet, I gotta get this card, 500 bucks and I'm gonna get $200 back. That's a no brainer. I like cashback cards anyway, as well as the fact that these cards don't have any annual fee. This is perfect for me. So I went ahead and applied for that particular card from Bank of America and I was approved and the limit on that card was $4,500. It's it's still $4,500. But um, I went ahead and applied for that card. So, so far I got the Blue Cash Everyday card from American Express, that's $200. And then I got the US Bank, I was like, what card was it? Then I got the US Bank Cash Plus Visa Signature card and that cash back was $150. And then I got the Bank of America Cash Rewards card and that was 200 bucks. The last card that I applied for that I got another 150 after I spent $500 was the City Double Cash card from Citibank. And the credit limit on that card is $4,300. Of course, I will link the application process. I'll link those videos below this video in case you want to check it out because I'm a nerd like that and I like to kind of show that when I'm applying for the car, just to kind of be transparent and so that you know what to expect if you're interested in getting these particular credit card. So of course the City Double Cash card is a really good card. Once again, this is also a cash back card. You're able to earn 2% cash back, 1% when you make the purchase and another 1% when you pay your bill. So of course Citibank is trying to encourage you to be responsible and re reward you for being responsible by giving you that other 1%. So once again, I was able to earn 150 bucks cash back once I spent $500 within the first three months with my City Double Cash card. So using those four credit cards, just real quickly, the Amex Blue Cash Everyday card, I got 200 bucks after spending $1,000 in three months. And then I applied for the US Bank Cash Plus Visa Signature card, and I got $150 back after spending 500 bucks within three months. And then I applied for the Bank of America Cash Rewards card. I got $200 after spending 500 bucks in three months and then I applied for the City Double Cash card where I got $150 back after spending $500 within three months. Now I cannot tell you how awesome this was. Once again when I apply for credit cards it's kind of like two twofold. Most of the times it's because of the sign up bonus, whether it's a cash back driven card or it is a cash rewards, not cash rewards, but points that you can take and redeem towards hotel, travel, and so on and so forth. That's kind of the first thing that I look for in regards to applying for a credit card. And then of course there's the annual fee. I kind of look at that as well. But another reason why I like to apply for credit cards is because I'm always trying to extend the amount of available credit that I have. The more available credit that I have, the easier it will be for me to stay within 0% and 10% of all that available credit. So when you're in between 0 and 10%, you're maximizing the 30%, which is credit utilization, in the credit score. So um, there might be a lot of confusion about that, but your credit score, when it comes to credit utilization, that is 30% of our credit score and it's very important for you to be between 0% of your overall credit limit to 10%. So if you had $1,000 and that was it, 0% to 10% would be between $0 and $100 for $1,000. So if I have $100,000, clearly, 0% to 10% would be a lot higher. That would be between $0 and $10,000. So once again, these are reasons why I personally apply for credit cards because it's going to make my overall credit limit greater, which will make it a lot easier for me to spend more money, so to say, and still be between the 0 and 10%. In general, I pay all of my credit cards off in full every single month. So whether it's a charge card, or a regular traditional credit card, I pay them off anyway, so it really doesn't matter. But those are the reasons why I like to apply for credit cards. And I just wanted to make a really quick video and kind of show you how fast your cash back or sign up bonuses can add up if you apply for multiple credit cards. Thank you so much for watching this portion of the video. What I wanna do right now is I wanna go ahead and give some love to my patrons over on Patreon. So I'm gonna put their name on the screen right now.
Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked the video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. It helps our channel quite a bit. And feel free to share the video with somebody that may find it helpful. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, be sure to smash that subscribe button and click that notification bell so you don't miss a thing. Once again, my name is Dwayne with HowToBuildCreditTV.com and I approve this video. I'll see you in the next video. Until next time, take care and be blessed. Peace.